come outside this fancy and expensive hotel, the Waldorf Astoria. Where currently inside sits a group of wealthy individuals to discuss how to fund the Israeli army's activities. The very name Israeli Defense Forces is entirely misleading and deliberately. They're not Israeli as in the representatives of the Jewish people and they're not there to defend anyone. But as we say, in every lie, lies some truth. And that is in the word forces. Day in and day out, they force their concepts and their blasphemous ideas on others. They force people off their lands. They force evil decrees and what they call a democratic government. That's where the force lies. This is not about defense. And this is not about Judaism. This is about a group of non-believers, terrorists, that have taken our name, and now they appeal to the world in our name. They appeal to the public for funds to carry on with their terrorist acts. People call us anti-Zionists. I don't like to say anti-Zionist. I like to say I'm pro-God. I'm pro-religion. I'm pro-humanity. I'm pro-morals. I'm pro-peace. I'm pro-human rights. And therefore, I'm anti-Zionist. Most people in the world are unaware of the fact that many Orthodox Jews oppose the State of Israel and protest against the occupation of Palestine. They believe that Zionism is a danger to peace in the world. One of them is Rabbi Joseph Antebi, who was tortured by Zionists. Uh, but let me start with a question. Are you not afraid to, afraid to invite a German into your home who is, if you look me up into the internet, uh, who is supposed to be anti-Semitic? A, a Jewish person should be afraid of uh, the Almighty. And uh, there is no special reason to be more afraid from you than other people. Uh, the expression anti-Zion as uh, Semite, is it, uh, is it being used by, uh, actually you are critical to the Zionism, uh, anti-Semite, is it used by Zionism to uh, reach certain goals? No doubt about this. For every human who will think a little about the attitude and the way they express themselves about these matters, that... Uh, Using anti-Semitism in context of um, European lands is to achieve goals, and especially those goals who are linked to the Second World War. I'm uh, I'm born I've been born in uh, Jerusalem, Jerusalem. I'm, I, I'm Palestinian Jew. My uh, grandfather was born like his father in Hebron from my mother's side and my father was born in the old city of Jerusalem and I prepare to show you the birth certificate in which it says that I'm Palestinian. Okay. I probably can take a picture and put it on the picture of Okay. Okay, we'll make a picture of that later. So, actually, you are Palestinian yes. Jew. You can read it. Yes, certification of registration of birth, Persian affairs, and Palestine. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that's weird because we think that Jews only live in, in, in the, well, not in Palestine, but what in Israel. Mm -hmm. But before Israel was uh, created as a state, uh, Jews and Palestinians lived in. in War, lived peacefully together for sure. for a long time. Sure. What changed then? Zionism, of course. Zionism is the cost of uh, the unpleasant situation that you have right now in the Middle East, and not only in the Middle East, in the whole world. Uh, some years ago, in the place where you're sitting, some um, Zionists came here to 
One was very strong, and the other one was uh, like the intellectual of both of them. And he, uh, they come here and they overwhelm me, and they treat me with electric shocks and injections, which make and break my bones, what make me very sick after it. Until today, I'm suffering. Unbelievable. When was that? Uh, it was in the date 8 March 2000. Have you been warned before something? Yes. Uh, the, they call me and they say that I have to close my mouth. There are records, uh, telephone uh, records, and the police were translating it. And they want to, me to do some so-called religious uh, acts as a covering for the crimes that they want to make. So they, they want you to be an, not a Palestine, Palestine Jew, but an Israeli Jew, or what? what, what they you? want to hide some proofs about a uh, harmonious life before, before the, establish, the establishment of the Zionist state. They want to show that uh, um, the state is necessary. They don't want to hear the Jews used to live peacefully with the Muslims and the relations were pe perfect and this is what I'm saying to the world constantly I'm Palestinian Jew and we have no feeling of animosity with the Muslims over there we have um, friends who are Muslims and we can cooperate and do with each other very nice when I compare to relations around the world the relations that we have with the Muslims in Palestine we, my father, my, my mother were very good. There is no, there was no reason to talk so bad about them, and for sure not to do so bad about them. We have no reason for it. Unbelievable! Uh, you are a Jew, and you have been tortured by Jews. Look, maybe it's better before we continue to say that I was tortured not by Jews, but by, Zionist. by Zionists. Okay. And it's very good that our um, the people who see us will make for themselves clear that Jews are not Zionists and Zionists are not Jews per definition. The people who behave like this already declare with this behavior that they are not Jews. Jewish behavior is uh, merciful and loyal for sure to the Jewish nation and for the whole world, all people. Um, so what is your solution for uh, or, or what what can you do or what can Jews do? Or, um, because obviously most people don't even know that, that uh, Israel is not um, the state of the Jews, but um, there are Jews that oppose Israel. Uh, d d can you say how many uh, of the Jews? Uh, okay. Are there any statistics who, who oppose Israel? Thousands of thousands of people. There is a big number. Not everyone is... Uh, willing to stand in front of uh, the camera and to declare this. People having families and people are afraid. You see, not everyone uh, can, can uh, take it to be kidnapped and tortured like uh, what happened to me. Your opinion is right. The state, the Zani state, is a wrong thing who costing us a lot of uh, problems in the world. When things happening there, and I'm walking in the street, I experience it very strong. People are angry and they see me and they think that I'm the representative of the Zani state. They don't know that we are not different as they suffering from this state. That's amazing, yeah. Uh, and interesting is also that we don't hear about that because, uh, I mean, the mass media has the opportunity to invite you to talk shows or whatever. Uh, are the media controlled by Zionists? Of course, no doubts about it. About my story, um, there was a, there is a big newspaper over here. It's called the Telegraph, the Telegraph. Yeah, mm -hmm. they were very interested about my story, and they were making an appointment to come to interview me. And after this, uh, just short after, they announced me that they will not come. And I ask why, they say, I ask, I ask also my lawyer, and he say to me that he himself is very afraid because he received some documents and it was clear that this organization who was uh, mentioned on this document associated with the Mossad.